so in the last video we set up our project and uh, while setting up the project we did some mistake uh, in the phone section like I forgot to add the exact path of the phone so let me just uh, add the path over here now the build will not fail okay and uh, in this video we will going to work on the splash screen if you don't know about the splash screen let me show you the example so when we run the app in the after installing the app or after relaunching the app what happened that you will see a white screen so at that when we see the white screen at that time flutter load the app so this is the white screen we see at the time of loading the app and i have added some code in the in the main dot dart file to just show you the demonstration okay so just you saw right that uh, after you open your app then a fraction of time we see the white screen so instead of showing the white screen we will going to show our logo okay and you will think that why i'm not using the mintra logo because right now i have changed everything that i'm not uh, using the name of the mintra or mintra logo otherwise uh, i will i mean it may happen that mintra can legally <laughs> tell me that remove everything about the Mintra. I mean, I, I don't have a right to use the Mintra logo or Mintra name anywhere on the video. So I am removing all the logo related to the Mintra. And this is a logo for our app. So this logo I'm going to use and we will going to work on a splash screen. So instead of showing the white screen at a time of loading the app, we will going to show our logo. To show the logo at a time of loading the app, we will going to use another package of the Flutter that is a flutter native splash so you have to add the dependency of the flutter native splash on your pubspec.yaml file just after the dependency so let's add it just after the get package and after you will add the get package and after you add the flutter native splash package on your project what you have to do that you have to copy and paste this code this line of code i already did so i'm just i will let you know that where you need to add this three line of code you have to add it before this dependency section and here i'm going to add that section of the flutter native splash in the flutter native splash section you have to provide the image path the image you wanted to show at the time of loading your app i will show you that how it will look like so i'm using the logo big dot png i have added three or four type of logo of our app this is a logo big logo black logo with color so i have added this thing and you can find the descript uh, you can find the github link on the description and inside the github repo you will find the image folder and all kind of png i'm using are there okay so you can find the logo or you can use your own logo for your own project okay so after adding the dependency and after adding the section of the native splash hit the save and pub spec will going to run and after running the pub, pub spec what you have to do that just go on the flutter native splash page and here they told that how to run this i mean how to create this splash screen so you have to run the flutter pub run flutter native splash create in order to fully complete the process so i have to run it and it will going to create a native code for the splash screen and after finishing this thing now what you have to do you just have to uninstall your app for the one time okay and after installing your app you have to reinstall it so let me just reinstall the app okay and then when we do the reinstall then we will going to see our flash screen so let me just let's install it again and let's wait till it installed and uh, from the next video we will going to work on the landing page and it is taking some time okay now it is installed then you will find that this logo is came instead of the white screen so we are showing our own logo you can see it again let me just open it let me just remove it and relaunch then for the fraction of time we are able to show the logo of our app so that is a splash screen okay so we set up the splash screen that is a 
main point of app creation and now this code you don't worry about this code i will put it as an example on the future folder that will say i will going to create a new test folder and inside the test folder i will put this example and it's nothing it's just to show you or create a thumbnail for me okay so don't worry about this code we're going to work on the actual page of the landing of mintra app or i will say inspired by the mintra this is our own shopping app which is inspired by the mintra theme okay so till that happy coding see you on the next video